Wow. You have to scream it, girl. <laughs> you tried. I'm gonna do it right here, and then you're gonna go around there. I know. I didn't know what way Dad was gonna go. But well, why would he go this? We're gonna work on it. It's not quite October yet. We're gonna work on it. Yeah. Right? She's been waiting. I was giving you the idea of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm the idea of she it. wants to do more scare videos <laughs> for October. You told. So that was our practice run. And we'll start for October, okay? Right, so I get to scare you? Yeah, game on. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> go do your homework. I know she probably gave you an assignment. Oh, it's an easy assignment. Okay, then go get it done. I just have to write my story. Okay, go. Hello friends. I wasn't gonna start our day yet because they're all still on calls and I haven't had breakfast yet. I have gotten ready for the day. Showered last night, did my hair and makeup today. It feels good to have hair that I actually like now and wanna do, but I'm over here working on my computer again. I've got oatmeal and drinks, but like I said, we weren't quite ready to start our day, but Ashley snuck downstairs after her call and I realized that Jason hadn't seen her. And so I was like, ooh, get down. <laughs> Let's try and scare Jason for the first time. We're gonna work on it, okay? Our scare videos are gonna happen, right? You scared last time, you scared Dad really good. I get him really good, and he doesn't he's, pay. Yeah, he's coming home from like... Yeah, he's coming home from something, and yeah. I totally got him. So that's our goal, right? All right, mm -hmm. so tell everyone, watch for the scare video in October, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna go eat breakfast. You're gonna go do your homework assignment. Let me bring it down, put it And we'll be right back. All right, we just filmed Jason's embarrassing moments. So you probably have seen that leading up to now. I don't know if Chelsea is doing PE in her room or if she was hammering on the, on the floor to tell me that we were being too noisy <laughs> for her call. But uh, that was kind of funny. It's just the life we live in. I was telling my friends the other day that uh, she's like, how is it with four kids? Because I think she only has like one or two or something like that in like virtual school. And I said, it's nice. Because listen, like it's quiet. And this is how it is. Unless they're like getting lunch, it's this quiet almost all day long. Wow, and it's so peaceful. It is peaceful. I'm, I thought it would be more chaotic. Oh, we're getting shushed. Um, I thought it'd be more chaotic having them all home doing school. They're just responsible and they're doing their own thing. And we get shushed more often than they do. So Jason and I need to go to, or I want to go to Target. He just comes along for the ride. I need to see if. I'm going to get air filters for our cars because all the oh, smoke. Really my car still smells like smoke. Okay. Well, when you, well, I'm just thinking the air filter for the engine probably needs okay, to be replaced. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we've got our. smells like smoke. We'll I've got to make a to-do list and we have 20 minutes until lunch time for the kids and that's usually a good time for us to run our errands and then be back for their afternoon call. You probably calls. need to turn on your AC, not AC, but... I did yesterday because I was air cold. Airflow from outside. I did. And, and get it flushed through. Yeah. We can see if the cabin filter is easy to... to I'm going to go make a list for Target. My you make car. a to-do list of like all the honeydew stuff that you like to do? What do I like to do? You like to do those kinds of things. Yeah, well, I didn't tell not, you we're to. Not, we're not changing the car air well, cabin filter in my car because you got to take like the whole dashboard. Okay, part. fine. But maybe you're. But I didn't ask you to do that. Just so we're clear. No, I do it because it needs to be done, and I love you. No sarcasm at all in that. Well, we already did Target, and I wanted to film in Target. It's just hard with masks, and it was pouring rain when we went in, and and then Kaylee called us like two minutes into being in there, and she's having problems with both of her computers, um, and she's supposed to be taking a test right now. <laughs> and I guess she was on the teacher on the phone call with her teacher for like a half hour, and then on the phone with Jason for a half hour while we were at Target, 
And I can't tell if it's a technical problem or a user error. I can't, I don't know what's wrong. So we're gonna rush home. Jason's here getting his car. I don't know what he had done. I think he maybe had his tires rotated or something. We're at Firestone. I'm just making sure he gets his car okay and then we're gonna rush back home. Abby needs to go back to Target with me. She reminded me while we were there that she needs to pick out a friend's birthday present for tonight. <laughs> so I'll take her back down tonight and then I'll get pizza for pizza movie night for the rest of us. Chelsea requested that last night when I was working on her homework with her. You know. What are you checking? All right, this is our exciting Target haul. <laughs> we were able to get one package of generic disinfectant wipes. You know, do what you can. And then bagels, because I still have cream cheese, but no bagels, it's like the vicious cycle. So now we're probably gonna run out of cream cheese before we run out of bagels, right? We'll have to reverse it. And we got four garbage cans because the kids are using white erase markers for their classes and they have tissues and papers and all that kind of stuff. And show them, show them what you got. We had some issues with putty being lost or taken. We're not gonna go into it. So she got a little pack of putty, even though I said no more putty. Then I got little trash bags for the ba for the cans because I'm sick of not having, or I'm sick of having gum and stuff stuck to the cans. And I still cannot find liquid soap refill, like the all, what is it called? Soft soap or even the generic. I don't know, I'm gonna have to keep looking around but I just keep getting this ever spring one. It's expensive, it's more expensive than I wanna pay but it's the only one that I can find for the bathrooms. And then we got some body wash for the shower. And I find that if I have a, a little pump on it and tell the kids only one pump, Ashley. I do. Then they'll use less soap. Um, so then, what else did we get? Dove soap. So then I got Dove soap and air fresheners for the car. Because I still feel like it smells kind of smoky, so. So we're still having internet issues, so I think I'm gonna go try and request a hotspot from the school. Everyone that initially wanted one that needed one, that only got one if you didn't have internet at home, I think that's all been done. So if they have any extras. So I think I'm gonna, but another friend has internet and she got a hotspot, because um, I think one of them works from home. Um, anyway, I'm gonna try and get one, because everyone at one point during the day is getting kicked out. And for my older kids, that's turning into a bigger problem because today, Kaylee is part of the problem is she got kicked out when she's trying to take this test. Which right now they're having kind of a grace period trying to adjust to all this, but it's gonna start to become a problem. So I'm gonna go and see if I can request one of those really quick and then see if we fixed Kaylee's problem with her computer. <laughs> <laughs> this man right here. You were holding out. Just discovered. I have a marshmallow in my mouth. Just discovered my bag. No! Yours is out. gone. It's yours gone. It's gone. Grace, you wanted to know, is it gone? It's, it's gone. It's gone. So that's yours. I even said in that video, his and hers. I didn't know there was a his and hers. <laughs> well, I did. This is mine. Mine can last me weeks. Well, that's because you supplement it with like a bunch of other things. No, I eat like four or five pieces and then I'm done for the day. And then you have chips, and then you got Yeah, coats. I had half a bowl of chips. And you have- You're not having- I can't- I don't, <laughs> don't trust him at all. I forgot you could see me in that. <laughs> I thought I could I'm literally that. looking at you in the screen, babe. Oh, I didn't- oh, yeah, I just saw an open bag and I was trying for it. I know. Mm, I'll see how it is. You're holding out. All right. Walk away! Walk away right now. Am I clutching this more? bag? No, I, they're $10 a bag. You $10. spent $150 last year on these snacks. <laughs> so no, you know, I'm not, I'm waiting for the rebate. Text and ask when the rebate happens. It helps when you have a friend who's a buyer for Costco. No, that's how we found out last year. I know. Text I know. him. 
Text him. I will, I will. It's not a super high priority right now. No, but you're not having mine. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it is. He's like, I'm just going to wait till she's gone. And then I'm going to steal these. And that's not going to happen. I need to find a really good hiding place for them now. So if you guys didn't know, we live in here in Seattle and our Costco is Costco corporate. And it's right across the street is their corporate offices. And anyway, so we have many, many, many friends who work for them. And one of them knows the buying schedule and has access to that because that's what he does. Last year, Jason texted him and he's like, hey, dude, find out <laughs> when these are going on rebate. And they went on rebate for $6 a bag. And I think Jason bought 10 bags. <laughs> I'm not even lying, you guys. This is why I said yesterday this is a problem because it's a big problem for her budget and for his belly because he just eats them like, anyway, so. lighting in here at night but we are going to end our day we kind of ended it well we just got pizza for pizza night movie night we'll find a movie on Disney Plus for the kids or something but we've spent the last two plus hours just trying to figure out how to submit homework assignments for our high schooler and for whatever reason technology is not her friend it's not a trouble like it just Every assignment you is showing. It and then it shows nothing. <laughs> yeah, it's showing not uploaded and not submitted, and so the grades are reflecting that, and that's unfortunate because we literally can see the homework. She's working hard. She's doing good. Yeah, we can see both it's the digital files and the physical. Issue. So it's a tech issue. So I've emailed teachers. I've documented every assignment that we have, and have files of trying to resubmit them, trying to figure that out. My, the computer is charging now, so I can't use it right now. It, this whole virtual thing is not easy, and I guess we just got an email for making the decision. It's a survey on whether we want our elementary kids to go back to school. Uh, so that's a decision we have to make. I mean, ideally it would be nice to go back to school, but cases are upticking like pretty much everywhere in the world, so I'm not really excited. I know. We're delusional. So we have to make our decision. not going to happen here. Well, I have to submit this survey by October 1st, but I haven't looked at the survey yet just have seen a couple of people talking about it online. I would rather they just stay home, honestly. I mean, I, the system actually is pretty good. We're just having glitches yeah, with, uh, with one, one kid's one computer. Kid's computer and homework uploads. and. But I would rather just stay in virtual scenario until the end of the year and then reassess. But they're talking about guys getting- down below tell us what your school districts are doing. Yeah, I think everyone else is in school, at least part-time. That's just kind of where we're at. I'm kind of like burned out. I'm now looking forward to pizza night, movie night. Yeah, let's call it good. Do you guys have a good evening? Yeah. Subscribe. You win some and lose some. <laughs> and let's go have pizza. Yeah. Okay, you guys take care and hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. Sundays are always good in general because they either get tomorrow a nap. Saturday. I know. I'm just saying tomorrow I don't know if I'll film or not. Depends on how. The kids are. I'm looking forward to Sundays just to relax, take naps, <laughs> and watch my Seahawks now. Take so this, uh, Halloween lighting here. I know the, the lighting in here. It's not any better. Here, I'll show you. It's not really. Maybe it's better out here. Oh, I guess it is. Guess I shouldn't end the day in there. So good. But Chelsea, really quick, is doing so good, right, Chelsea? You're just not on videos very often because you're always playing. She's doing a little project here. This is super cool. She drew all this comic strip about. What is it about, Chels? <laughs> you gotta know. So, it's like the Europeans were trying to go to Asia, but or not. Like, not Asia. They were India, trying to go to India, but ended up in the New World, which is well, which is the Americas. Yeah. Right. So she's doing a little comic strip about it. So she's working hard. She's got to submit that by tonight. So. By twelve. You're not staying up till 12, so you've got till bedtime, my friend. But we're gonna have pizza. 
Yes, I know. It's Friday night. All right, you say good night because you never say good night anymore. Somewhere. You always put your pillow over your face so that you don't have to be on it. Say good night to everyone. They miss you. Okay. Night. <laughs>